Alright, let's see what we got. So we got Monstrous Shrine, <laughs> not great. Mad Grit, save the best for last, and Dead Man Switch. Dead Man Switch and save the best for last will definitely come into play, I'm sure. So the, the Alan Wake is our obsession, so we need to uh, watch out for hitting him with stacks. Also, I think you can't hit with them twos anymore with save the best for last. I don't really want to stop to read it. I don't want to give him any uh, any more of a, an early start. <laughs> the Wake is here, though, so we will friends her. Respect that pallet, and then hit him. Also, we're using two add-ons. One increases the uh, the frenzy, I think, only by two seconds. Um, and then the other one increases the lunge, so we can get a longer lunge there. That's the hit again. Where's the rest of him? One's over here. Maybe healing up with the wake. We'll see. Oh, wait, no, that is the wake. Okay, that's weird. <laughs> Guess he mended too soon there, then. That's why uh, you should always be careful mending up early against Legion. Because now we could get an insta down. Need to swing quick. Ooh, we just about get that. And now we get the insta down. Down goes Jakey boy. Alright, perfect start for us. Amazing start. Let's get him up. No stacks of save the best for last yet though. Progress on that gen. Let me just get rid of this pallet first though. Get rid of the pallet and then we'll go give this gen a kick. Not sure if anyone else was here or if that was just the gen that the Jake was working on. Gen over there blocked with Deadman Switch. That's the Fang accounted for. Let's go for it. Hit with that Frenza. They're moving in, so we'll meet him around this side. Okay, they were moving in. I guess they changed their mind. That's the lunge. I think I might come in, see if the Feng's here. The Feng might be moving in for it now. I mean, he's almost second phase. It'd be silly to move now, wouldn't it? We may as well uh, force that second there. <laughs> yeah, there goes second phase. Wait, so did he crouch around? I actually don't know where he went there. All right, they did get the save. Let's give. Let's uh, kick this pallet. We could go for wake again as well. Not built up any stacks yet, but that is because we've just been taking M2s, which is good. We do want to use the power. Go for wake again. Might go for a double vault there, you know. Double vault. And then we lunge. Who's this guy? Is that Jakey boy? Gonna come with a vault. Nah, that's Ada. Okay. Uh, you know what? I might even chase this. Yeah, she wasn't expecting that. Caught her out of position there. We should have her. Yeah, we definitely do. Alright, down she goes. There's our first stack of save the best for last. Let's pick up as well. First gen done. Let's break this. We didn't break it a second ago, did we? Break this and then break this one as well, I think. Deadman switch on the gen over here. Just seeing them move down here as well. Whoever it is, they're injured. It is going to be the Fang. I want to push it this way, actually. Deny her that good window. There's the vault, and then there's the down. Second stack is save the best for last. We are slowly building them up. Let's get you on this hook as well. There's our challenge done. I think that was um, put three different survivors uh, on a hook, so pretty easy, to be honest. Deadman switch again. Been getting some decent value from dead man it's not amazing value it isn't an amazing gen defense perk on its own but definitely it's not bad oh wait he moved down here for some reason which way do i want to push him i want to push him this way uh you know what? i want to break this <laughs> hopefully zone him a little bit yeah not really he's still got that it's not amazing though does have a pilot in front of him we'll keep that in mind at the vault. There we go. We should have him there. We do lose our stacks though, don't we? That's the thing. It is what it is. We'll get him back later, I'm sure. And then Deadman switch on that one there. We'll give this one a kick first and then we'll move him towards the other one. There he is. There's Jakey boy. He's injured and dead as well. Unfortunately for him. Was that life? I don't think it was, was it? It would have made more distance if it was life. Alright, GG's for the Jake. We'll take a, a stack of uh, Save the Best for Last as well. There you go, though, Jakey boy. Let's get you on there. They've got the save. We'll give this a kick before we move back in. Hide the red glow a little bit. 
There's Ada. Healthy as well, so we will go for her. Get her injured quickly. There it is. Could go back for the wake and then... Feng as well, I guess, if she's moving in down here. We're not going to get the... In well, we could get the insta down, but we need one of those guys to mand up. Nah, we're not even reaching that anyway. But we have Feng isolated here with just a little pallet. I'm just going to break like this instantly. Uh, she did move pretty quick, though, so she'll probably make something. Oh, uh, she might not, actually. She's got a pallet there. Nah, no pallet there. Does have the window. Good fast fart on the window. And then lithe as well, was that? Yeah, definitely lithe. I think we should still have it pretty quickly, though. There was a pallet over there in that corner. She doesn't make that. She doesn't make anything. All right, now she goes. Let's get you straight up. Two gens left. Looking good. Could go frenzy, but they are both injured. Yeah, there's no point going frenzy. We'll take our pallet. Appreciate that. Does have a pallet there, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> did he vault back? He did not vault back. We'll play it. Pre vault. No pre vault. Look how good Wake is. <laughs> Alright, we should have him here, though. Moving away, does he make anything? I don't think he does. Trying to rotate back onto that other pallet, I think. Yeah, we lose our stack again. We've not really had much value out of Save the Best for Last, have we? I think the only perk we've really used... Wait, can we use Mad Grit here? No, we can't. We need, like, Unrelenting and everything, don't we? Do you know what, like, where you spam the M1 when you're taking them to the hook? So I think Mad Grit only helps there if we actually hit someone whilst carrying uh, someone else to the hook. Dead man's guiding us over here. Scratch marks over there in the corner. The Ada. She's dead pretty much. Oh, wait. She might have a pilot here, actually. Now she goes. We get our first stack of um, save the best for last once again as well. No pilot save. Don't know where the thing is. I was hoping she'd go in for the save, but maybe not. She might just be playing hatch at this point then. Let's kick this. See what she does. See if she does move in for the saves. No, she's not. She's here somewhere. There she is. Well played. She'll vault in now. Stay for the fast fall as well, played. And then she does have live and then a pallet to the left if she wants to play that. She's not playing that for some reason. Guess she didn't realize she had a pallet there. Alright, down she goes. So we do finish with one stack of metal, man. <laughs> but yeah, GG's. Let's get her on a hook and then let's move on to our next game. GG's. All right, let's see what we got. So we did get Hysteria, uh, Beast of Prey, Third Seal, and Jorin. Yeah, not a great build, I'll be honest. Our, our last one was definitely better with Dead Man's Switch. But we'll see what we can do with this. We'll see if we can make it work. Third Seal, uh, maybe catch him off guard a little bit. Hysteria does make them oblivious as well. I'm actually not sure exactly how it activates. I, I don't really want to stand still and read it. <laughs> we haven't got time for that. We do get one stack of third seal there, though. Uh, Beast of Prey, I think, is like scratch marks or something. Or is that Predator I'm thinking of? Who knows? We're not making anything here, though. Oh, I tried to do a lunge there. That wasn't a lunge at all. We should get a nice M1, though. Okay, maybe not, actually. Unless she carries on going. No, I did stay. All right, we'll just take the pallet. We'll take the pallet and then leave. So, yeah, Hysteria might be when a survivor loses a health state or something. Or when you injure a survivor, something like that. Third seal, not in an amazing spot. Right near the middle. It is a little bit away from the gens. It's kind of close to that one, isn't it? But it's not right next to it. We'll do Frenzy. That's weird. Why would you not go to pallet, though? Questionable movement uh, with the Jake, there. Window tech incoming. No window tech. I think I'm just going to come out of Frenzy here. Yeah, no one's nearby. I think I'm just going to come out of Frenzy, give this a kick. And then maybe move back. We have got Hysteria, so they may be oblivious. She's seen us coming there, though. Again, weird movement. We'll take the double vault. We'll also take the god pilot if she wants to give it us. 
Go play window is that will play. Closer to vault that. And now we get the pallet. We'll take it. We can continue chase. Wait, window's not blocked. Yeah, that's weird. Maybe she went in chase the first time around. I want to go for the Jake here. Uh, let me kick this first and then we'll go for the Jake. Because he did our questionable movement before. We'll see what his movement is like now. I think it's pretty good now, though. He's just holding forward, moving ahead. Now, he did go up here. Let's see how he plays this. Let's play in the vault. If he wants to play Shark, uh, down goes third seal. If he wants to play Shark, obviously no god pilot. We did just get rid of it. Yeah, terrible movement. All right, we got him, though. We'll take that. Gen speed's looking good, though. Definitely going to be a tough game, this one. Let's put him in the uh, on the hook in the corner. Yeah. That way, when they get the save, if we're nearby, we could come back, get two stacks of... Um, or two inches, I guess, with our power. There's the Kate. We're not going to chase. We'll just kick this and then... Maybe check on this one here. I don't want to move too far away from it. She's moving back in, I think. Did go in for the save. She's moved back in. She's not going to stay for long, though. We'll go Frenzy, I think. Just when I've got line of sight on him. We'll do it now. Jakey boy first. And then this girl as well, hopefully. Obviously, has to play window. Window tech. No window tech. Fair enough. Ooh, we're lucky to get that. She got very unlucky, though. All right, we get Jake again. Jake has been unlucky both games, hasn't he? That's twice now. Got caught out of position there. I think she was trying to take the hit for him. She was nearby. We'll pick up. Let's hope no flashlights. I don't think they had flashlights. Yeah, they didn't. Where's the nearest hook? Tell you what, we'll drop him there. We'll slug. We'll go for the UK. Damn, look at that gen speed. All right, we, he has to get picked up, unfortunately, because we're not going to make a hook. There wasn't one nearby. So we'll put her on the hook, and then we'll go back in for the Jake. See if anyone's getting the pickup. If they pick him up and we put him back down, then we can pick him up. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. Yeah, let's go for him. <laughs> he's second. Uh, he's second hook, isn't he? Doesn't have a great loop here either. Yeah, just the window. Let's see if he has lithe or anything. No lithe. Could have balanced. Uh, nah, he won't have balanced actually, will he? Most likely won't because we are playing Chaos Shuffle. <laughs> Beast of Prey activated there. I'm not sure why exactly, but let's get him up. I want to take him, like, more sort of to the center. Uh, actually, we, we can't really, can we? Let's put him on the hook in the corner there. All right, so he's death hook. Uh, K is second hook, and then the other two haven't been on hook, I'm pretty sure. So we'll definitely need the Jake later with only two gens left now. Didn't move in for this one. How about this one? Didn't actually move in for this one either. All right, the gens aren't looking too bad now then. There's someone. Where did they even go? Very stealthy. <laughs> I definitely seen someone here. Who knows where they went? We'll move back in. We'll see if we can get a double hit with our friends here, with our power. We'll see what they do. Want to get line of sight on them first. Oh, wait, they did heal up at hook. Let's surprise him. Come on then, Jakey boy. There's the Jake. There's the Ewer. You know what I'm going to do, actually? I'm lucky for you, Jake, but we need you out. That's fine if you want to take a nap. Whilst the Jake is in chase. <laughs> That's a wall, son. What are you doing? <laughs> oh, lucky Jake. All right, let's get you up. It's unfortunate for the Jake. Uh... The Jake has kind of had the shot under the stick in both games, hasn't he? First game, he went second there, and then... They did get the slug up pretty quick, though. First game, he went second, and then he did find himself out of position there. The mistake they made was healing up at hook. It was a bad move against Legion, especially when he's on, on death hook. I don't want to chase there. She'll take us into main. I'm gonna go Frenza. Respect that. Go for that lunge. Is this the healthy girl? Okay, both of them's here, so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> I 
I thought I'd go for it. Because we was about to uh well played as well. Played that well there. I was about to run out of uh frenzy. Had to take a chance. Wait, she's still there. I thought she left. Stealthy girl, I think that's the one we've seen before, isn't it? It makes sense. Let's get you up. Hook kind of far away. Uh, not too far away, actually. It should be fine. Unless they've got Breakout, Metal Man, Saboteur. Oh, they actually have. <laughs> they actually have got a Saboteur. Or, oh, was that a tool? No, that was just Saboteur. All right, we'll go Frenzy then. Window Tech. I tried it anyway. There's that lunch. I thought for a second it was going to say someone was over there. But it didn't. Let's lunge past her. And then hopefully we've got a pretty quick. She does have a nice pallet there. She run back. Yeah, she did. Maybe lie. They actually couldn't tell if she had lied or not. Again. No mind game, mind game. <laughs> it did work as well. Alright, let's break this. Alright, Katie's death hook next time around. So I want to check on the gens around here. I don't think they've got any progress, but I just want to be 100% sure. We do want to defend our gens here. This one might have a little bit. Yeah, this one has got quite a bit, actually. It's like halfway. Seen scratch marks there. We'll give this a kick first, and then we'll move in for them. And then the survivor that's not accounted for will get the save. Yui. Okay, no, that's the one i seen before. I remember the blue backpack. I actually thought it was blue hair at the time, but it was the backpack. She did go up here as well. I thought she'd play distance there or head in towards the hook. But she decided not to. Might play window. Interesting movement. Down she goes. Could maybe end it here by going in towards hook. We're not going to do that, though. We'll just put her on the hook. It's actually first hook for her as well. But yeah, it should be GG's anyways. I'm not even sure they'll get the save. Even if they do, it shouldn't matter too much. Yeah, they did get the save in time. Played. There she is as well. <laughs> she just stood there looking at us then. We did get rid of this, didn't we? So we should have a somewhat quickly here. Uh, I think she has one more pallet there, doesn't she? She doesn't make that, I don't think. Oh, no, she does make that, actually. <laughs> Palleted back. Back again. We do have bloodlust, so it would be a shame to break it. I tell you what, we will break it now. Because she just zoned herself there. Ran back. We do have her, and then we've got a hook right next to her as well, which is perfect. Oh, she goes. I don't think we've used Endure in this game, have we? I actually forgot we had Endure. Yeah, maybe I shouldn't be respecting Pilot so much with Endure. It's just kind of um, kind of hard to break the habit. Like, I'm always used to respecting Pilot. Like, I don't over-respect them too much, over-respect them. Yeah, it's unnecessary to, like, go, go straight through them and just get stunned if you can prevent it. It depends on the circumstances as well. It depends, like, what, you've, what else they've got nearby, how long the loop is, etc. Okay, that time I was really, I was willing to uh, go straight into it. We should have her there, yeah. Just about get her. Very close, unlucky. Kate played well. She did get unlucky at uh, a couple of loops. But yeah, GG's for the Kate. This one's been a tough game, though, hasn't it? Very tough game. Lucky we got the Jake out somewhat early. Oh, not so much early, but, you know, sort of like just after halfway. Gonna come back in and kick this because we know it's, uh, it's actually almost done. Look how close that is. And then I just want to check on this one. We do have a nice three gen here. So we'll just keep patrolling our three gens for now until we find someone. But yeah, just that middle one with progress. That's actually bad news for them because when there's a three gen, you want to you want to split split up and do the, the two that's furthest away. You want to like avoid the middle one. I want to hit her and then try and find the other girl. Other girl went in for the gen. She, she was trying to bait us away. It might actually be enough, you know. I don't think it will be. Yeah, it's not. I was going to say, I don't think it will be, but it might... <laughs> you know what? I think we're going to kick this. I think we're going to kick it because they could move back in. Uh, so we'll give that a kick and then... Because now we can find them. Now they're both injured. She ran over there. Again, we don't want to get baited into a long chase down there. We do want to kind of stay near our gens. Our gen, I guess. The other two don't really matter. They've not even been started. Okay, there she is. This time we'll chase. That's fine. Alright, down she goes. She got pretty far there as well. I wasn't expecting it to get that far. Want to use Frenzy just to get over here quicker. Just to see if she commits to this. Well, she was here, but I don't know if she still is. Let's come out of Frenzy. See them scratch marks? Nah, I don't know. Oh, wait, she's dead. She's just dying on hook so a friend can get a hatch. Understandable. 
And then by the time Hutch spawns in, we will have our frenzy back. It spawns in like a weird place on this map. It spawns like sort of around the edges, typically. I mean, it can spawn in main and stuff like that as well. But let's check around the edges. Did go for the heal there, understandable. Also, even if we do find it, there's a good chance the exit gates will be really far apart. Because it is a huge map, this isn't it? He's our frenzy again. Okay, yeah, she did get Hatch. Alright, there we go then, GG's. Fun game, that one. The other one was as well. Uh, let me know what you guys think of this game mode. Let me know if you've played some killer. If you have played killer on this game mode, which killer is your favourite to play? Um, but yeah, thank you all for watching, guys. Appreciate you all watching. And as always, I will see you all next time.